this is a large villa. I'm not sure if anyone actually owns this. If it's actual player housing or what. Um, or if you can buy it. I, I don't know at all. Um, completely lost. Hopefully some someone can tell us. I have no idea how long this video is going to run guys, so apologies if it ends up being quite long. Um, I'll try and get as much footage as I can, as it's quite a interesting little outing we've got going on here. As you can see now, the sun's starting to rise again, so it's not night anymore. Like I say, the world does look really quite nice and some of the cities and stuff it's got a cool art style uh? learned that yesterday <laughs> forward slash air underscore guitar one of the things I do wish they added was a um uh, a bit of a smoother party system, uh, maybe like a link in your like an empty button there. I don't, I don't, I don't know what they could do, but like, I mean, if you're near someone, if you press G on them, if Kane and still, if press G, you can invite to party and start a trade, which that, that's perfectly fine. That's easy. Um, but if someone's not near you, then you have to use like forward slash commands. Problem is that, as far as I'm aware, there's no. I could be completely wrong here, I'm probably wrong. I don't know of any like one single website which just lists all the the latest commands because there is I found I came across one but it was all outdated and obviously I mean since the game's launched some of the commands have changed or been streamlined to be a bit easier or whatnot. So it, it was outdated so when I was trying to use them commands they wouldn't work so I've had to ask in obviously in in the clan chat. Um, which isn't really a major big deal, but it's just a bit annoying. I would like to have a one website, or even the actual on the actual help page itself on the Darkfall site, just to have all the commands there, so it's a lot easier. I think it looks like we're gonna do another bit of sailing. I'll see. Don't want this video to get too long. Three parts of ten minutes would be pretty good to aim for. I'm hoping to eventually be able to show you guys some proper sea combat and proper PvP battles, but I can't tell you when that'll be. That looks awesome. I cast in my healing spell just for fun. Let's see what it does. Doesn't work. Ah, oh, because I need a regent. Of course. So yeah, I haven't been doing too much PvE. I went on a little raid with a couple of the guys the other day. On uh, I think it was on the Saturday. We had a really good run. Getting some. That's where I got my armor now. Like I say, this is my old gear, so it's not my proper stuff, but some good stuff from there and I bought a helmet from the shop. Um, I've started doing some crafting as well. Um, just been doing some some of the bowyer stuff to make some arrows because arrows uh, it's good to be able to make your own obviously. Um, yeah but a, t a tip for you guys if you are hoping you are wanting to make arrows is that because it's, it's a bit misleading, it doesn't really specifically say in the craft panel but when you are crafting arrows it does actually make a stack of 20 um, so that's something that I was concerned about, that the materials look quite a large amount and I was thinking I was only going to get one arrow out of it um, but no, you do get 20 so not an issue obviously we haven't seen the Kraken <laughs> I don't think he'd be out at this low shoreline. And the guys are going back to get the fire, like a new campfire. 
cook some food. I don't have any pots on me, so I won't be... Because I mistakenly forgot them. I do have... Everyone gets the ability to cook by default. Which is cool. And all you need is pots and pans, which you do get from one of the starter quests. But otherwise, I believe they're 20g to get. So that's not too much. Everything, most of the stuff is 20g, like your tools, your basic tools. Um, fishing rods, and hammers... Uh, you know, that kind of stuff. Like I said, sacks are 20g as well, which again is not much. I think another tip to give is that any of the rubbish that you seem to find from enemies, even the very first goblins that you're killing, because you will be killing quite a lot of goblins in the start, um, is to to keep it all, to bank it all. Um, stuff like bones that are used for um, spellcasting. You, if you keep them, they can be used. Oh, sweet! They they can be used or they can be sold. And I mean, I sold a guy to one of the guys in the clan earlier. Sold a hundred and something bones, lower hundreds, like 107 or something, for four G each, which came to like about 400 and 20 G, I think it was. I sold them for, which you know, that's a pretty good number. Um, and that was literally just from keeping the the bones that I got when I was ki killing the goblins in the start. So there's definitely something advisable. People are always wanting to buy stuff, but if you are uh, selling to randomers, do be careful because Darkfall again, full free open world PvP. So it's best to do. I would imagine it's best to do trading within cities, um, so you kind of covered a bit. Uh, at best, definitely sell to other clan members, because um, obviously you're going to be safe there. But, but yeah, it, do, don't really. I wouldn't advise doing trading in the wild because they could just come along, kill you, and steal all your stuff. And not obviously not pay you for it. So, wouldn't do that. Um, yeah, trading definitely does seem a good way to make make up some money. Questing is where I got most of my money from initially, um, and just selling some of the crap. You don't really get much money selling stuff to vendors, um, but I did sell some of the basic stuff that, like some of the basic weapons that don't stack. Um, anything that stacks, I do again. I do recommend keeping any materials and whatnot. Definitely keep. Um, yeah, still waiting for the campfire to do some cooking. Crafting, oops, crafting is basically as easy as you literally you bring up a panel, go to the certain things. So, like for cooking, you go to an oven or a fire, um, and you basically don't click use on it as long as you've got your required tools. Then it'll open up a panel, um, and you simply click on what you want to make as long as you've got the the materials in your in your inventory then you can make them and it tells you how much you need of each thing so for like arrows it'll say I don't know I think it's four iron ingots or something and one piece of wood um, and yeah it's really really simple uh, some might argue that it's not too advanced but to be honest I mean I'm not a crafter in games I, I really I usually just co I completely avoid it in most MMOs I don't even bother I just buy stuff um, 